Good morning, ninja kittens. Good morning, hello kitty warriors. I am very happy to see you today. We, our hearts, are filled with love today. And we are going to make the world a better place. We are going to help friends and strangers too. We are going to put love in all that we do. We are going to let love flow through us today. Uh, today is Friendship Friday. F R I D A Y Friday. It is Friendship Friday. And I want you to call or write or text or wave at a friend today. And if you consider me your friend, let me wave at you. Hi, friends. Hello, friends. Hi, all you friends out there. All you friends in Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok, thank you for being my friend today. Thank you, all 419 people that are on my YouTube. Thank you, 30,000 people that are following me on TikTok. And you, 1,000 people on Instagram. Good morning. I thank you today. Um, I am not alone. Uh, I am connected with everything. Uh, goddess, power, higher power, God, divinity, uh, however you want to call it. I'm not going to define it for you, but I know my God loves me. And I've got love flowing through me today because of that. So here we are. The update. Ooh. My most popular videos have over 400,000 views on TikTok. Uh, I consider that pretty dang viral. There are other ones with 40,000 views, and I don't even if they're if, I don't even know if they're are viral or not. Maybe just people just watch it because they want to watch it. I don't know how do you define viral. I don't know, uh, but I do know I love spreading love and light. So you know about the Hello Kitty Warriors. Mm -hmm. What does it mean to be a Hello Kitty Warrior? Well, if you give love with open hands. If you're dedicated to make our world a better place. If you help friends and strangers too. If you see something wrong, you make it right because you can. Then you are a Hello Kitty Warrior. A warrior for love. A warrior for light. You're a ninja kitten and you make everything bright. <laughs> now there are samurai kittens out there trying to change the world. They have set rules and set tools and sometimes set tools and sometimes they hit you over the head with them and that hurts. But that's not us ninja kittens. Us ninja kittens will use anything we can get our paws on to make this world a better place. Maybe it's a badge minute machine. Maybe it's a sewing machine. Maybe it's your knitting needles. Maybe it's your pottery. Maybe it's your clay. Whatever it is. Maybe it's your claymation movie you're making. Whatever you have, whatever your, your gift is, you're using that to make this world a better place. And that's your intent. Spread love, spread light. Someone says, Sandy, how do you stay positive? Well, you are what you eat. And that's not just uh, vegetables. Not just, not just fruit. That's not just grapefruit. That's not just uh, hot lemon water in the morning and taking my vitamins and my, uh, my hormones. No, that's not it. Uh, what you are what you eat is what you take into your eyes, what you take into your ears, what you take into your heart. Take good things into your heart today. And if you find me a good thing, if I'm chicken soup for your soul, eat it up, friends. <laughs> Enjoy the hell out of it. And, and, and then you will change how you feel. You will change what you give to others. And then you can give love and you can give light. Because love is supposed to flow. Love is not a stagnant thing. Love is not something you can hang on to. It's something you receive. It's something that you let fill you. And it's something you let flow through you. So the answer is love, love, love. The answer is love, love, love. And, you know, <clears throat> I've been asked, so many people have asked me to tell my story over and over again. Every time I get on live, there's someone telling me, tell me about your trans journey. Tell me about your trans journey. And they're asking me, actually, to listen to Sandy's ghost story one more time. Now, it's out there, okay? Several different versions of it, including one I made just for TikTok, is out there on my YouTube channel. And I, if I get more than 20,000, if I get more than 20 people on a live TikTok and they ask me nicely to tell my ghost story and I'm not actually doing something else, and I'm just chitting and chatting, I will stop and do it because I would gladly tell you the story of my life. But that's not for now. 
Now it's time just to say thank you and tell you about the Hoop of Love project because we're making hula hoops for the whole world, okay? And I'm just one little corner of it. I'm just, you know, I'm just in the, this little place called Ohio, northern Cleveland, greater Cleveland, where I live, and I've been handing hula hoops out. So uh, one of my neighbors saw me with hula hoops yesterday. They were an older couple. And I said, you know, if you want a hoop, you can have one for yourself or for someone else. She says, I like the orange one. And the husband goes, I don't think you need that. I said, well, you can give it, keep yourself or give it to a friend or a relative here. And I gave her the orange hoop. So now one of my people that live in my apartment complex has got a hoop of love. Hoop of love. Okay. Uh, <laughs> my people at the bank have hoops of love. Okay, they got it. I still need to deliver my hoops of love to the Red Cross. Uh, my store has an abundance of hoops of love. And then my neighbor's store nearest to me now has 15 hoops of love distributed amongst their crew. So bang, 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 hoops of love have gone out. And I'm out right now. So I have no more PVC, the garden PVC, the three-quarter inch that I need to make hoops with. I need to go get some more. Uh, so if you have 50 cents or, or a dollar, when you send me the picture of Hello Kitty, send me that, and then I'll have enough money to buy more hoops of love, hoops of love. It costs about $20 to buy a 100-foot roll. And that's all I need is 20 bucks to buy a 100-foot roll, and I can keep on making hoops of love, hoops of love, hoops of love, hoops of love. And one of the best markers to use is a silver marker from, um, um, from Office Max. Office Max has these silver markers that were just perfect. You can write on the hoop itself before you put the duct tape on, or you can write it on the hoop afterwards, which I did this last time. I wrote hoops of love on the top of my hoops. When I handed them out. So they're likely going to come off when you hoop for a while. But still, they say hoops of love on them. Ah, hoops of love. Hoops of love. Hoops of love. Mm, so you remember Laura from Hot Topic. Okay, if everyone loves my makeup, so I say, oh, Sandy, we love your makeup. That's what went viral, actually. The makeup videos are just the most popular. Um, but Laura from Hot Topic, the person that gave me this hoop, I'm hoping with right now, the original hoop of love, also, the same day she told me about Big Hoops are for Big People and promised to give me this hoop, she showed me Unicorn Snot the same day. And she told me how wonderful it was, the body glitter that you could put on your eyes and it would just make them sparkle and shine all day. And I went, oh, wow, okay. I fell in love mm -hmm, with Unicorn Snot. I mean, you know I love Unicorn Snot. I use it every day for five years, or well, four years, whatever. Uh, I, I love my Unicorn Snot. And I love hula hooping, so it's like, all right. So I hula for long periods of time. And this Saturday, Lord willing, weather permitting, I'll be out at 2 o'clock uh, in my favorite spot. Uh, and anyone in the Cleveland area who wants to come and wave at me and say hi, they can. Just stay six feet distance. I won't have any hoops this year because I've given them all away. But if anyone wants to say hello, as long as they stay a respectful distance from me, uh, I can respect that. And if you want to just drive by and wave, you can. It's in the Cleveland area. It's by the Metro Parks. It's by the Little Met and the... Uh, horses, and it's across it's across the street from the running, the walking path. So I'm across the street. I have my Hell Kitty flag. I have my Hell Kitty staff. And if you can send a picture or a video of me of what you see, that would be the cat's pajamas. <laughs> so uh, it's Friendship Friday. So uh, to my friend from uh, Alberta, Canada, who sent me uh, two wonderful, beautiful face masks. There were Hell Kitty face masks. Thank you very much. I got them safely. Uh, I'm ho I haven't, I don't, not sure if you know it or not yet, but I've been showing it off and telling everyone, this is my first TikTok gift. This is my first TikTok gift. This is my first TikTok gift. Uh, sort of like I, I tell my friends at work, I, I went viral on TikTok. I went viral on TikTok. Sandy, shut up. We know that already. Okay, all right, all right. All right. I'll be quiet. No, I won't. You know I won't. <laughs> Anything I do to s spread my positivity, as you like to call it, or share love and light, either way. Uh, that's what I'm dedicated to do. So the answer is, today is Friendship Friday. So today, tell a friend, thank you. Thank you for being my friend. Throw an airplane at him. Make him an origami uh, animal, if you can. Uh, or just call him up, or text them, or FaceTime them, or whatever, Skype them, or whatever, whatever you do nowadays. <laughs> but let them know that you're thankful that you have a friend in your life. Um, I miss people. That's what I miss most about this quarantine thing. People ask me, Sandy, how are you holding up in quarantine? It's a good question. And the answer is, I'm in pain. And it's not physical pain. Sometimes my shoulder is, hurts a little bit because I'm getting up there, you know. But no, it, it's an emotional pain. I miss people. I miss people from the, the Cleveland Flow Collective. I miss the Cleveland Drum Circle. I miss my friends at South Park and, and um, at Belden Village Mall and at... Oh, 
at Beachwood Place and at Great Northern Mall. And oh my God, I miss these people at Ultra Beauty. I miss my friends at Sephora. I miss them terribly. And I'm wishing them well and I'm praying for them in my heart every day because I know some of them can't work because their jobs are shut down and they are stuck in their homes. Um, and we're trying to open up uh, to keep things on a financial, uh, we're, we're alive footing. But the virus is still here and people are still dying. And I know this too. And I'm in danger every day. But I put myself in danger for the people that I love. And I'm wearing my mask. I'm staying safe distance away. But I have no idea what tomorrow will bring. But today, I've only got today to worry about. And today I will bring love. I will bring light. And I will fight to be the best little girl I can be. Just a little bit better than yesterday. Yesterday I had such a relaxing time. Such a fun time. And I spent a lot of it with you. I had a picnic with you. I did makeup with you. I had a chat at night before I went to bed. I felt like I was just chatting with my friends. And there were friends from all over the world. People were shouting out from Ireland and Australia and other places around and places around the country, from Texas and from Ohio, from where I live, okay? Uh, from Brook Park, Ohio, where I grew up. Someone said, I'm from Brook Park, Ohio. And oh my God, I grew up there. I went to Westbrook Drive. They said, my, my, my mom and dad, they went, to Brook, uh, they went to Mid Park High School, where I went when I was young. And they're 61, and I'm 62, so we likely actually passed each other in the hallways. Uh, it's like, what? How this world is so small, and it's so large, and it includes all of us. You know, it's like, oh my God. Mm -hmm. So my friend from Brook Park, Ohio, that actually lives near me, if you want a hoop of love, all you gotta do is, you know, instant message me, say, Sandy, I really want one of your hoops of love. Can you uh, drop it off? I drive by your place every day. I mean, I, I, I drive through the city of Brook Park every day to get to work. Okay, so I was like, mm, I'm going to get more PVC. I'm going to make more hula hoops. You want one? Just, just let me know, girl or guy or anything in between. It doesn't matter. People ask me, are you a boy or are you a girl? It doesn't matter. I'm a drop of God love. Is what I am. Who am I? I'm a drop of God love. I consider myself female. I identify myself as female. I am her. I am me. I am she. I am her, I am me, I am she. I'm Sandy Ellis Haas. I'm a good girl, a lovely lady, a wonderful woman, and a pretty princess. And I just started my day with 12 minutes of hula hooping conversations. I wish you well, and thank you for being my friend today. So get out there. Spread love, spread light. Tell your friends thank you for being their friend today, because it's Friendship Friday. Let the whole world know it is Friendship Friday. Thank you for being my friend.